hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and on today's video we're going to be styling my pixie and i did wash my hair last night in deep condition so i like to just mist my hair then drenching it because i find like if you have just have like a little bit of water in your hair it's easy to dry it so it dries quicker and i'm just combing my hair to prepare it for the mold and i've been loving like just molding my hair like down um like back back and then front to front like starting from the crown it actually looks good even though like the part is like my go-to hair style but and to mold my hair i'm going to be using the design essential composition wrapping set lotion And I'm taking my right to comb and I'm going to start laying down my mold. And now that everything is kind of like laying down perfectly i'm gonna go ahead and create some waves in front here and i'm not gonna create a part so just like a little little waves here in the front it just looks nice after after like styling your hair or curling your hair like that definition here in the front So now I'm going to take some wrap strips and wrap my hair. And I always like to start at the nape and going up. So now I'm going to go ahead and dry my hair and then I'll come back. So my hair is dry now and this is how it's looking. And I'm going to show you the back as well. So everything is completely dry. So now I'm going to go ahead and apply some heat protector. This one is Heat Defense by Tresemme. And I'm mostly going to apply it on top. This way I'm going to uh, curl my hair. And I'm also going to apply this Jamaican black castor oil hair food to moisturize my hair.
so now I'm gonna start killing my hair and I'm gonna start from the crown going back and then I will do the front you can use a mirror if you want but I just free-handed and hope for the best but it always like turns out pretty good so if you want like the more professional look maybe use a mirror
So I am done curling my hair and this is how it's looking. This is the back and the front. So I'm going to take my white tooth comb, but I'm not really gonna comb out my curls. I do like them when they are tight and I'm gonna tie them down. So I'm just taking my white tooth comb to comb like the back mostly because I wanted to blend with um, the nape area because I didn't curl it down here. I just don't want like that gap in between and also like here on the sides but I'm not coming out my mold, just blending everything on the edge here. And then I'm also gonna use it a little bit to direct my curls into the direction I want. Mostly like on the edge as well here. And now I'm taking my scarf and I'm going to tie this down So I'm just gonna leave this on for like 20, 30 minutes while I do my makeup and then I will come back and show you guys the final results. So I am back now, it's been about 20 minutes and I'm going to remove my scarf. And this is how my hair is looking and this is the back. So now I'm gonna go back with my red tail comb and just like wake my curls up a little bit can actually just use my fingers to just like finger comb and style everything like nicely So this is what I normally do like in the morning if um, my hair is styled I just go ahead and like finger comb it to kind of just like wake it up in a way. So this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and don't forget to share guys like please share my videos so that other people can also learn how to do their own hairs at home and yeah I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.